Hi, welcome to our channel and thank you for turning in. Today I am delighted because I am going to show you how to make one of my favorite dishes, which is pastelón de plátano maduros. So what this dish is basically, just imagine a lasagna. But this dish, it's basically just um, yellow plantain, ground beef, which we bought um, fresh beef from Costco. And I am going to use my beautiful KitchenAid machine to grind the meat and also cheese. It's delicious. And of course, I'm going to use my sofrito to um, season the meat. And the link to my sofrito, it's right above here. So if you just stay with us and we'll see you in a little bit. Okay, I'm gonna start grinding the meat. So this attachment came with two wheels. One is fine and the other one is coarse. So we are going to use the coarse wheel. So I'm gonna turn my machine on and little by little, start feeding the pieces of meat to my machine. I'm going to add the sofrito to my meat to so just give it a flavor. And there is a link to my sofrito down below. I started boiling the water for the plantain and once it started um, boiling, you can add the plantains. And I have at least, more or less, eight plantains that I am going to boil for this recipe. Allow the plantain to come to a boil and add a teaspoon of salt. See how tender my plantains are. I'm heating a teaspoon of oil and we are going to add the meat. Ok, 
Okay, now I'm going to add a little bit of my adobo to your taste. Okay, now my meat is ready. It's cooked, but it needs color. Now I'm going to add two heaping tablespoon of tomato paste. One of the ingredients that I like to uh, use on my pasta long is raisins. And I'm going to use three little boxes. Now that my meat is done, I'm going to proceed by turning my oven on. We're going to put it, we're going to turn it on to 350 and start. And then I am going to put the pastelon together. Now I am going to continue by mashing my yellow plantain, my sweet plantain. You're just doing like a, a mashed potato, the way you do a mashed potato, that's what you do. And just want to make sure that it's oh, they're all softly mash. You're going to add two tablespoons of butter. So your baking pan, the one that you're using to bake your pasta on it, needs to be slightly coated with butter or cooking oil, cooking spray. So now you're going to continue by just adding your plantain and making a layer. covering the bottom of your pan. See, it's just like making a lasagna. Now, at this point, you are going to add your cheese. My kids love monster cheese, so I make it with monster cheese, but you can use um, Sharp cheddar, mild cheddar. It's to your preference. Some people use, some people use mozzarella cheese. I prefer monster cheese. So now you're going to add your meat. Only one layer of meat. Now, if you're enjoying this video, now is a good time for you to go and subscribe. Okay, now you are going to add another layer, or I'm going to add another layer of cheese. At this point, just add another layer of your mashed plantain. And this will be your final layer. You can use all of it and spread it evenly.
my pastelon is done. We're going to take it out of the oven. Oh, it smells so good. Mm. Final product. My pastelon is done. I'm going to give it a taste and see how it came out. I'm going to take delicious salt. Mmm. You can taste the cheese, you can taste the meat, of course the plantain, the sweetness, it's just delicious. Go ahead and subscribe. Thank you for watching. Enjoy it. Bye.